Living in the overworld can get kind of boring. So today, I'm moving. My plan is to travel down to the nether and build ourselves the ultimate nether survival base. And that way, I'll never have to leave. Goodbye, overworld. Who needs ya? And here begins my new life. Oh! It's fine, I'll get used to that. Be gone! Yeah. But okay, our first objective here is to go find the perfect location to build this base. Preferably somewhere near a giant lava lake. Like this area right here. Well, all right. Perfect. I'll take it. My plan here is to actually build the base on a custom nether island in the middle of the lava lake. So I grabbed some blocks, hopped into the lava, and begin building a little outline. And the verdict is very big island. What do you guys think? Too big? Too small? I I think it's the perfect size. Except that's a lot of these pig creatures that keep spawning here. How to neighbor? Oh, 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 that backfired. That backfired. We can be friends, right? I guess not. And now I need a new totem too. Dang it. But anyways, now it's time to fill this thing in and make the actual island. So we're gonna need... Excuse me. I'm trying to do a little commentary here. We're gonna need some materials. We're gonna need some grass, which I don't have right now. We're gonna need some soul soil. And of course, we're gonna need one of these guys. Okay, I promise no more overworld. I'm being serious this time. I am never coming back. See you never. Alrighty, Roo. So we're gonna start things off by putting a nice trim around the island using soul soil. Kind of to represent like a beach. Uh, I kind of want to get it one down. Oh, be careful, 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 careful. Get me out. Uh. Easy peasy. And for the mainland here in the middle, we're gonna be using all this grass. It literally makes no sense in the nether, but it just catches your eye, you know? And as we complete this fabulous nether island, please subscribe and hit the bell. I'm gonna get evicted one of these days. But yeah, this island is not looking very safe. So we might have to take care of that later on. But besides that small hiccup, this place is looking really cool. Oh, you know what else would be really sick? If I grabbed some of these bone blocks and made like some fossils sticking out of the shore like, like this. Ooh, Farzy likey. <clears throat> I mean, Farzy, Farzy approves. Oh my God, stop! These pigs are ruining everything. Why are there so many of them coming towards me? But after sprinkling in some fossils and patching up the lava holes, it was time to start mapping out our base. So the vibe we're going with here is like a castle design. So basically, we just gotta make a giant rectangle and build upon that. And I, I can't, I can't build the rectangle right now. Oh, wait, I have what you guys hate. Mushrooms, yeah. I run away. What are you afraid of, a little fun guy? Well, I'm a fun guy. Yeah, get in the lava. <laughs> this is not going to be easy, is it? So these will be the walls. And over here on each corner, we'll make a little bit of like a tower kind of thing. Uh, I'm struggling how to make a circle in Minecraft. One, two, three. One, two. Ah! Stupid geometry. And the far away view says... Oh, yeah, that's actually really good. As far as he knows his shapes, what a success. Ow. Uh-oh, my elytra broke. And I'm surrounded by piggies. Hi, can I have your XP? Thank you. Okay, okay. I know what I said, just... Just be quiet, okay? I swear this is the last time. Eh, who am I kidding? But all right, let's go build ourselves a nice big castle. All right, let's figure out what blocks we need for our castle. Perhaps some black stone, some crimson wood, and... Ooh, do they still have that, like, red nether brick still in the game? Oh, they do have it. How do you make it? Is that netherite? Oh, no, 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 no. I thought that was netherite. It's nether brick. Okay, I can definitely do that. That makes a lot more sense. Okay, so let's start this thing off by building up the towers. And I'm thinking we do the towers as like the redder blocks and then the walls can be the black stone. So yeah, we just place blocks for a while. Place, place, place. Break, break, break. Get killed by a piglin. That was not a planned joke. Oh, I hate this place so much right now, but I'm gonna live here for the rest of eternity. <laughs> Dude, no shot this land here is gonna get in the way of my castle. Yeah, it's definitely gonna do that. Well, looks like we gotta do some terraforming as well now. This is already becoming a very interesting project for me. And, okay, nice, strong, firm, but it's still kind of ugly because here at the top, we need to well, first eliminate the pig up here. Get down there. 
Yeah. But if we sneak over here, we gotta make the castle like spike thing. So we're gonna go stair, block, wall, something kind of like this. Oh, much better. That actually looks really cool. But I think it'd look cooler if our castle had four towers. And I swear, I didn't even do any editing tricks. They all just spawned in naturally. But now it's time to build those beautiful castle walls. Right after a quick word from today's sponsor, BetterHelp. BetterHelp is a platform that makes finding a therapist easier. For a lot of us, we can have a hard time truly feeling happy, whether it be certain situations, past experiences, or just mental health issues, sometimes being happy is just more difficult than it needs to be. But that is where therapy comes really handy. BetterHelp's mission is to make therapy more affordable and more accessible by helping you find an online therapist in as little as a few days. Now, for me personally, I go to therapy because I used to get really stressed, and I felt like that stress contributed to an unhappy lifestyle. But after working with my therapist, I feel like I'm happier, things just feel easier, easier, and in turn, I can make better Minecraft videos for you guys. So if you want to give therapy a try, use the link in my description, betterhelp.com slash farzy. That link will give you 10% off your first month of BetterHelp, so if you want to try it out, I highly recommend you use that link. And again, I really want to emphasize that I use therapy myself, and I think it's a game changer. So give it a try if you think it'll help you. Okay, as promised, we're going to use some blackstone to fill in the castle walls, which means we're going to have to take a little trip to this old place over here. Hello, Bastion. Ow. This is what I want. These bricks are gonna be perfect. Oh, these blocks are so good looking. Ooh, what are you? Gilded Blackstone. Oh, I need some of that. Get in my belly. Thank you. Okay, it's wall time. So we're gonna break this line. And now we're gonna place down some blocks. Do these colors even match? Eh, sure. Why not? On we go. Can somebody please enlighten me how to make these guys stop spawning? Oh, wait. Give me that. Not what I had in mind. If I can just borrow one of these. And... Hello there. Nothing to see. I'm wearing a gold helmet so you like me. Oh, I'm so smart. Oh, I probably also need another totem. BRB. But after getting the totem, I was back building the castle walls. Yeah, that looks pretty good, I think. And yes, the front wall is intentionally shorter. I have kind of a cool plan here for this. But first, we gotta make a giant door to actually enter into the premises. Is this the middle? I don't know, but we're gonna find out. So we peel it back this way and come over here. No, you can't enter. Yes, my friends. Yes, attack the pigs. I was kind of concerned about them, but looks like we got it covered. It looks all right, but it is kind of bland right now. Okay, plot twist. We're gonna go up another level here using stairs. Cause, well, I don't know how to explain it, but I just think it's gonna look cool. What is happening right now? There's a child on a child's head. Where are the parents? This is not safe. Oh, am I the parent? Where was I? Oh yeah. And would you just look at that view? Oh, it's amazing. Now we can walk up here and walk into our brand new castle. Well, that's a lawsuit waiting to happen. Let's fix that, shall we? Farzy is unsuable. Unless someone just goes like this and falls and breaks their legs. But besides that, I'm crime free. And to finish off the walls, I got some more red nether brick and made this amazing trim around the top. Oh, dude, this thing is coming together now. The trim just added so much more life to this thing. Oh, no, <laughs> there's a child down there in the pit. Well, that's a good segue to us needing to actually fill in these little walls with a walkway. Because no one deserves to fall into the pit of misery. Whee! Eh, not that bad. But all right, let's go get some blocks. We're gonna need a different kind of red blocks. I don't wanna use all the same blocks over and over and over. I definitely could go for some of this netherrack, but what else? Oh, wait a second. What if we used red terracotta? My brain says no, but my heart says yes. Hard it is. Actually, wanna hear a secret? I never actually go in that portal. I just run through, then I back up and go down to this portal. I've been lying to all of you. Where was I? Oh yeah, the walls. So we jump here and we're gonna place netherrack and mix in some red terracotta and you just go like this. And as far as the genius, yeah, not bad. I'd call that a big old W. Oh, wait, there's no staircase to get down here. Oopsies. Wait, Farzy has a plan. I place down this and I take some of this and I make stairs and I do this. Uh, uh, uh. 
it. Uh, I honestly think it is good enough. Probably not my best work, but it'll do. And now for the final exterior detail, I want to make the outside look a little prettier. So we're going to build a dock. So I'm thinking we use some of this warped wood just to kind of mix it up a little bit. I don't know. Is this going to look stupid? I feel like it might, but I'm already invested. I've mined like four blocks already. All right, let's do this. So we're going to stick some logs in the lava that I can't reach right now. Everybody, hold on. I'm going scuba diving. Oh, oh, yeah, I'm burning. Come on. Oh, you go so slow in the lava, man. I'm just taking my time here. I'm kind of scared. Please hurry. <laughs> okay, the hard part is over. I already regret building this thing. Almost done. Please don't look dumb. Eh, you know what? That's not bad. I thought it was going to look a lot worse, but actually, I think I'd like it. I was a little bit scared about the color, but I think it actually blends in pretty well with the whole build. But now, if I ever need to sail back home because my elytra are broken, we now have a place to go off of. Well, at least we can still make it look pretty. Nice. But now that our base is fully safe from the outside, we can segue to the interior. And as always, we'll be using colored wool to map out where things are gonna go. My plan is to start out by building a giant castle for me to live in, then build some specialized houses for food and materials, and of course, we're gonna need an anti-gas defense system, because gas attack preparedness can save lives. You never know when they're gonna strike. Like that! Always be ready. But okay, it's castle time. And since the majority of our base is red, I kind of want to use something lighter. Like... This stuff. Quartz. It's pretty and it's, it's nice and light. Yeah, we're using quartz. I wish these were easier to get because they all spawn on the roof. They're literally in the most inconvenient place possible. But I digress. 2,000 years later. Okay, that should be enough. Now we're just gonna grab some other blocks to kind of mix in. And let's do this thing. I gotta say, mangrove trap doors go really well with netherrack. Just please don't burn. But okay, we have this giant tower here, which I actually think looks amazing, but I have to figure out the top of it because I didn't really plan this far ahead and I don't know what I want to do here. Um, maybe I make it like a wizard tower kind of thing. Let's just keep raising up the walls like this and put some windows in. Yes. And a little bit later, we have a giant wizardy tower. I'm not gonna lie, this was not the vibe I had planned for this build, but I actually kind of like it. We go inside and there is absolutely nothing here. But after making a nice little staircase, we have a beautiful home here at the top of the tower. Be quiet. But yeah, it's pretty sweet up here. Oh, wait, I probably shouldn't actually use a bed. I kind of forgot bad things happen. Well, that was not what I wanted to do. I was trying to be funny and that just almost ended my world. Yeah, let's never do that again. But carrying on, I needed more than just a place to live. So I got some more materials and built three more houses for us to put stuff in. All right, this place is looking pretty good now, huh? It kind of has a Christmassy vibe, but I don't care. I think it looks really cool, actually. But all right, for the insides, first off, I need a supply of food. And I could make a hoglin farm but I don't know how to do that. So we'll be using pigs instead. Okay, everybody, follow me. We're going to a magical barn where everyone is happy and alive. Yeah, let's go with that. Oh, oh don't do it. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, yes! They survived! Oh, I'm too good at this game. Okay, piggies, come along in here. Good. Now all we gotta do is block off the entrance and put down a chest full of carrots to breed the piggies. And give me food. Thank you very much. It's kind of a barbaric system, but it gets the job done. Now, in addition to food, we also need some armor and tools so we can, like, mine and defend ourselves and stuff. And that is why we have a chest full of armor stands and death. Armor stands and death. Excuse me, sir, I have a gold helmet on. But yeah, we're gonna display this gold armor in the building. So we go boom, 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 boom. And approximately 15 to 20 more booms after that. Wait, I thought you could give armor stands tools. I swear that was a feature. Well, I'm sad now. My plans are ruined. I guess they gotta go in a stupid, boring chest now. And for the last building, we are making a netherite mine. <laughs> 
Okay, so the idea is we jump down the ladders here and we can mine netherite at the bottom right here. I don't know if that makes any actual sense, but looks like I've been TNT mining around here. All right, well, it makes perfect sense then. A ladder straight to the source. Nice. Now the base is coming along great, but before we finish up with everything, I gotta take care of something really important. Last episode, I said if the video got 10,000 likes, I would travel down to the warden's home and survive with no items. And you guys absolutely smashed it. So a deal is a deal. Let's go do this thing. Oh, I'm scared. Okay, the cave should be right down here. So the plan here is actually really simple. We're gonna throw all our items into a shulker box so I have nothing on me. And yes, I mean everything. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we have to survive. And I'm thinking we can only leave here if I get a full set of tools, armor, and five skulk catalysts. Sounds good to me. Okay, first things first, I gotta loot these chests. Oh, we got a hoe. Okay, we got some tools already. Oh, Oh, wait, there's wood right there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This could make my life a lot easier. Okay, now we take the wood, we make a crafting bench, and we make a wooden pickaxe to collect stone. Big brain Farzy. Sword. I'm already out of sticks, so that's all I can make. So on we go. Come on, where's the wood? Yes. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. And much better. All right, tools check. Now for the armor. Oh, I think he heard me. Break, break, break. Don't want these things. Oh, I want you. Is this thing silk touch? Uh, I can't pick this thing up. I'm just now realizing the skull catalyst may be really annoying to get. Being very, very careful. Please give me some armor or silk touch. Okay, I'll take that, I guess. Oh, come on, I want to get up there. Give me some of these. Come on, baby. Give me some loot up here. Come on. Oh, armor. Yes. I'll take that. Thank you very much. I also really need some food right now. What can I eat? eat in here. Come on, food please. Uh, oh, well, I already have that. I'm getting duplicates right now. Uh-oh, there's a warden nearby. Please, something, anything. Oh, that's all duplicates again. Okay, not good, not good. I'm gonna eat my apple, and I'm gonna take my blocks, and I'm gonna... I don't know. Uh, I think we got away. Oh, golden apples, that's huge. And a potion, thank you very much. Oh, that's massive. Uh, Come on, give me something good. Oh, a skulk, a skulk. Okay, we got one. We're making progress here, boys. Just gotta keep running away from the wardens. Oh, uh -huh. uh, uh. oh silk touch. Oh, baby, Let's go. Now I can grab some of these, mine some of this, and that is how you get a full set of armor. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I forgot to make a helmet. Why did I make more pants? Oh, I'm so stupid. One second. And now we're complete. Boom. All right, now get me out of here. I am sick of this place and I want to go back home. See you later. But that being said, if this video gets 10,000 likes, I will make a Minecraft song. You've all heard me rap, but wait till you hear my Minecraft singing voice. Like the video. But carrying on, we still had to add some final details to polish off the nether base. I built a beautiful lava fountain, some amazing nature gardens, and a hoglin trap to assert my dominance against them. Just wow, this place looks so good now, and I even have my own little prisoner. That's what you get for smacking me all video. Oh, wait, how can I forget the most important part of the whole video? The anti-gas protection system. I have the perfect plan. I just gotta grab some snow and a few pumpkins. We're gonna have our very own archer army by putting snow golems up here on each tower. What? No, don't tell me. No! But snow blocks don't even melt in the nether. Why do the snow... You know what? I don't care anymore. If the gas kill me, so be it. I'm not happy at all right now. I've lost all ambition to play this game. No, 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 no! I knew this was gonna happen! Die! Ah! See, we're fine. Just a few minor damages here and there. Ugh. Yes! Perfection! But all right, guys, that's gonna be officially it for our nether base. Make sure to like, subscribe, do all the good stuff, and I'll talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.